I'm uh, Brigendra K. Singhal. Uh, I'm an electronics and telecom computer uh, specialist. I'm 80 years old and I'm uh, still working at a consulting firm. I had the ICT practice. I had had a chance encounter with Dr. Balbir Singh. When we were uh, leaving his chamber on the 10th of November, uh, I suddenly felt very uneasy and then I toppled over. So when I saw him first in the OPD, he had a block on the ECG, which was a, a conduction system block. And I was thinking of how best to treat him. So I was discussing with him that we have to do some procedures. We have to do a pacemaker. We'll have to replace his valve non-surgically. The moment uh, everything was done and he was about to leave the room, he collapsed. After that, uh, I completely passed out. All I hear was sounds of Mr. Singhal, Mr. Singhal, Mr. Singhal. Fortunately, he was still in my OPD. He had not gone out of the room. I am told now that I was virtually gone. If he had been out of the room, I don't know how we would have saved him. But maybe if we would have saved him in the hospital, but not when he, if he was in his car. Uh, in fact, by the way, the same thing happened with my wife. When uh, she was consulting him, she also sort of felt uneasy and she also collapsed uh, more or less in front of him. When this happened, we gave him cardiac massage, took him straight to the cath lab, inserted a temporary pacemaker, which was followed by a permanent pacemaker on the same day. Having done that, um, we looked at his kidneys, uh, kidney treatment was started. So the valve replacement was done after about 10, 15 days when his pacemaker part was completely settled. And well, now we knew that we had a safe patient to take for a TAVR. We did his TAVR, he did extremely well. His heart has become completely normal. He's not feeling any breathlessness. He's back to routine work. Dr. Singh and his team really took care of us like we were family, um, for which I'm grateful. And I'm sure and I observe that he does this with all his patients. He's treated us like his own rather than just a doctor. Dr. Singh, I must admit, has given us both a second lease of life and I joke with everybody now that our birthdays are 26th October and 10th November. We are virtually reborn in the hands of Dr. Singh. Virtually reborn in the hands of him. We were both gone. We wouldn't be speaking to you. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and press the bell icon to get the latest healthcare updates.